So this is the second part of the computer science lesson. So please subscribe to me and my fellow friend Gameboy0012. I hope you enjoy it. Let's wait until he comes. Hi, Mr. Arnold. Yeah, hi, Sir Hill. Uh, good morning to you. Good morning to you. How are you? I'm doing really good. How are you? Good. Where is Billy? Pardon? Where is Billy? Uh, he left. Why? He didn't enjoy computer science that much. How okay. come? He said it was too much vocabulary and he didn't like you. How can you not like me? Exactly. I'm surprised as well. I like you. So you don't like? Not really, I do. Yeah, of course. Well, he'll get a zero. Anyway, today's topic is the social and economic implications of the use of computers. Do you know what that is? Pardon? But, sorry, what does that have to relate to computer science? Social and economic stuff? It's in the book! So what? Everything in the book is right. Sahil? Yes? Books are right. Computers are the devil's book. Oh, really? So you're saying computers are stupid? Computers came after books. Okay, fine, whatever. I'm listening. I'm yeah. listening. And so, now we're going to talk about algorithms and their methods of representation. Do you know what an algorithm is? I've heard it. I, I think, is it like a job that creates a specific uh, function for specific objectives? Maybe, you'll never know. What is a pseudocode? A pseudocode is a type of, uh, it's type of, it's type, type of an algorithm. No, wrong! It's a method of describing the design of a system. No, but it's a type of algorithm, isn't it? A, there's pseudocode, there's a flowchart, there's even a DFDs. I'm even telling the information before you're saying it, so. Well, it looks like I'm a better true. computer science teacher than you. Yeah. You want to teach the class? I might as well. At least it'll be more fun. That's it. Yeah. Make me. Make you. Yeah, make don't, me. Don't make me get this though. No. I I'm, know you did so. I'm not getting out. <laughs> oh, you're not getting out? No. What are you laughing? <laughs> I'm not getting out. I'm going to tell Mr. Fox. No, please do. I'm really. I, 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 I'll be obliged if you do. That's it. You're getting a secret. Sorry. Shame on you. I had such high hopes for you. Say it. I'm so disappointed. Okay. Thanks, guys. Thanks for watching.